Kilda team, Chris Fahey here. Hope you're going great. Today I'm checking out Kane Hora's new development at 139 Grays Ave. So 139 Grays Ave is a state housing project. The development features 276 apartments plus space for communal facilities, support services, and Kaingora offices. Acquiring land for large central city developments like this is usually a challenge, but in this case they were using a site that they have historically owned. Previously, the site was a large block of state houses that was built in the 1950s. The design of that block was actually a prototype for future buildings, but the government changed its approach in the 1960s and decided to stop building high-rise state housing. One of the interesting things for this project is Kaingoro is using a social procurement approach. In short, they've agreed a set of social outcomes that will be achieved with the help of their lead contractor, Icon. This social procurement approach is a really cool way for a developer to further the goals of their core business and contrasts nicely against the opposite of just paying some money to get a building built. In terms of current progress on site, I'll be honest, it was a bit of a challenge to get some snaps because our mates at Icon had put up some really tall hoarding. That said, I managed to get some and you can see that demolition is complete and right now they're doing groundwork. Completion is expected in late 2022, so it'll be some time before we see the finished product but I'll make sure to stop by again later in the year so we can check out the progress. So look, really cool project with some nice social outcomes in there too. If one of your mates is involved, then please tag them in the comments, or if you just thought this video was cool, then yep, go ahead and smash that like button. Cheers, bye.